What up, guys? CP the Tool Addict. Another AES Wave tool haul coming at you. I've um, got this and this little. It's kind of a nice box they hand this. They get this to you on. It's got a little handle on it, and whatnot. But uh, we're gonna jump right in because we got a lot to talk about about this bad dad right here. That's right. This is the AES Wave U Test Connect. U Test Con. U Test Kit. Bah. Sorry. You know, some days I just can't talk. Today is one of those days. Comes in a very handy case here, and we are going to open this bad boy up. And I'm going to try to scroll you around and get you into this as po much as possible and talk about it. Now, I did buy some add-ons to this kit. Comes with this here card here. I bought these add-ons right here. These amp these fuse amp loops, um, which are different amp. If you see the ends on them on here, amp loop differences. Now, <clears throat> I want to point this out. Because I also bought that, if you see, you already saw the video on the, um, the, re the reason why I didn't buy the master kit, which will make sense now, I bought the IPA fuse set, uh, fuse saver set. Well, I have connectors now. I can pretty much build what I need for fuse loops and stuff like that for fuse, fuse stuff. But uh, this comes with your standard fuse loops right here. You know, your uh, mini fuse loop. Uh, maxi and uh, I'm not gonna pull them out and bore you with them but this is the ATC so we're just gonna kind of go over this kit quick quick as I possibly can talk about some of the uh, features and benefits of this kit this this extra fuse loop kit is extra and this is for your uh, this is an updated kit that this is an updated piece that does not come with your kit so remember that when you go to buy this this is separate I will put the link for the description for this all down there uh, let's go ahead and quick run across. Let me scroll you up. Let me scroll you up and kind of just throw you on, throw you in on these. You're gonna look right here. Um, you're gonna see that you have over here. Let me kind of zip you in there. Actually, let me uh, let me let me pan this thing in the correct way instead of being. All right. So. You're going to have start off over here on the end here. And uh, we're going to have some Micro 64 pins, which are definitely pretty relevant. Um, and it's got all of your places up here for them. Your flat .08s. Uh, it's got all the numbers and whatnot up here nicely engraved in here, 4.0, 3.5. So it shows all your terminal ends, and this comes with a whopping amount of terminals, obviously. Eight per... Eight per section um, on these orange for your male and female, four and four. So then you got four and four of the blue ones, uh, which are the uh, Micro 64.08s. Um, dark blues. These must be, these are seven inch terminal leads. So these are all seven inch long. Um, these right here, gray ones, another .08. Um, pretty much your, uh, all most of these are, and then you go into your round terminals, flat spades, um, over here, which you guys, I'm sure, are well aware of those for some older stuff, but here's your round ones, and then your, uh, more round pins right here, nice kit, they all set in there, and I'm sure if you guys have seen some videos, especially, um, Erico, he's got this kit, um, Cody's Auto Diagnostics, Scanner Danner, all of these guys use this kit, it's pretty much a standard um, probes right here, we have the, uh, piercing probes, not, uh, not too much a fan of these, they're alright, but, uh, I mean, pan this down, sorry, sorry fellas, let me get you, get the camera work done here, camera guy's fired, he doesn't follow my hand as well as he does, uh, my face, but, uh, yeah, piercing probes here, they're kind of, they're okay, I'm not really too jazzed about them, now, what is cool is, is these leads right here, We'll jump right into these pin tip probes with removable insulator. So what's cool about these is, if you look, it's got a pin tip in here. But guess what? You take that off, bam, now you can take one of your, let's just take uh, let's take this, this, this right here. And now you can take this and put it on your lead for a back pinning on the probe. Pretty damn slick. Great idea for that. Um, you cannot... <clears throat> I mean, I couldn't, that, that, there's nothing better about it. Now, uh, let me put this, they're kind of a sucker to put them back in here, but 
they do fit nicely, guys. I will tell you that. This kit is pretty much, it's a must-have. I'm telling you right now. It is a must-freaking-have, without a doubt. Let me get my, get this thing set up back here. Um, and obviously the positive is the same way. And they have cutouts in there to get them out quick, which is nice. Same same type of connector with the banana jack plug-in. Definitely, definitely love those. I will be using those a lot. We got a variable resistor. Um, you know, pretty standard. This does have a lock on it, which is handy. This little lock right here comes in, will come in su super handy if you're doing variable resistance testing. Um, these little guys right here are pretty cool too. Um, these are some uh, micro pin back pins. Um, back pro bleeds. Let me show you these little these little suckers are small. And, I'm, and I was warned when you do get these. Oops, when you do get these, to always pull on these down here because they'll separate from here, and then you can actually have a bad false reading or whatnot. So I was warned. I was forewarned about that. Just gonna set that guy in there. Some basic alligator clips. Let me pan you over here a little bit. We're going to get looking over here into the side. Um, so we got just some basic alligator clips. This is really cool right here. These are for your airbag testing. And what's cool about these is you take this off and you can put your little resistors. And they actually give you some resistors with them. So you can put the uh, desired resistor in there. Check your airbag with them. Really cool. I actually seen saw a video on that. Um... Let me see here. Knock that little rubber boot back off. <clears throat> this is also cool right here. Thought this was really neat. So these leads, these leads, you can set these up for different triggers or whatnot like that. But these uh, these come apart right here. It's got a little plastic screw. And all these kind of shake apart. Well, obviously, you got your ground. that You're always going to have your ground. But that way, you can kind of have things running all over and set them up. Uh, I don't know how much I'll use this because it's kind of advanced to have everything set up like that but it's definitely can have different deals set up and they all come apart uh really cool nice little deal there to do that put these guys back together and it's just a plastic nylon screw so it's nothing crazy you don't have to keep it really super tight get this tightened down and let's dig into the boxes here the leads are pretty nice they're actually some of the nicest leads ever I've, I've ever had to see, and you get uh, you get angles and straights. There's your ground and your pot, or both your grounds, and uh, then we get both of the uh, angled, positive and straight. Let's see what else we got in here. Got a hook for hanging wires. Definitely kind of handy. I love this little pouch. Well thought out unit here, and then of course we've got some more banana leads, which are absolutely these are for back pin probing. So that way you can get the, the micro probes in there. <laughs> and uh, just some more smaller alligator clips. Um, I like these because these are stackable. So that's really nice. Um, other than that, pretty handy kit. You're definitely going to have... This is definitely a kit you want to look into. These are about $200 for this kit. Pretty uh, sweet kit. It, in any aspect, if you're not a major diagnostician yet, you should have one of these kits. I'm telling you right now. These pins right right here alone, uh, all these uh, all the pins up here on your uh, deal are absolutely these pins up. <laughs> these pins alone up here are well worth the two hundred dollars. The rest of the stuff pretty handy still. Um, you know, very, a lot of this is going to be dependent on what you're going to use. These amp loops are kind of nice. This this little micro probe is pretty nice too, but uh, these these are absolutely outstanding. These cover almost everything in. This is an updated kit, so I think it pretty much covers most everything that you're going to have out there. So, anyways, guys, AES Wave U Test Connect kit. Um, this is my second one, to be honest with you, and I, and the other one uh, I basically sold the other one because my buddy needed it, <laughs> and uh, I said I'd get another one. They were out of stock. He needed it worse than I did. Um, so I offered it to him just being a nice guy and now I got this one back in. So anyways, guys, that's the video for you. I hope you like it. Remember, like, comment, share, subscribe, ring that bell. Appreciate you guys as always. Stay safe. Remember, keep your hands dirty and your money clean. Thanks for watching.